Good evening, my people. Um, a few weeks ago, I ran a 5K with my daughter. You know, uh, that Saturday, it was it was real windy. It was snowing. It was bad weather. Three inches. The surface is real slick. It was thinking about canceling. Okay, so the last lap of our 5K, the wind started to pick up. Pick up, snowing, coming on harder. Uh, the surface is even more slicker. It just got tougher. It was it was a challenge. And I, and I could look at my daughter's face, and I could see her eyes, and I could see that she wanted to give up. Nah. We ain't quitting nothing. You know, I, I'm no, I'm not gonna quit and she ain't gonna quit. So you know what? I, I was I was a motivating her, but I was motivating her spiritually. And I was using God. I was like, nah, we're gonna keep this thing moving because you know what? The enemy wants us to quit right now. It's tougher right now. It's tough. So you know what? We're gonna get through it. We're gonna prove him wrong once again. And this whole time we running, I was encouraging her and telling her we cannot let the enemy win. And you know what? We got through that challenge. And the reason I did that is because me, you, and the rest of the world is, in life, we're going to face so many challenges. So many challenges, that's a part of life. And we got to be able to get through those challenges. We got to be able to get through them. So I told her, I was like, this is something you are going to always remember. And when things get tough, and you come back and you talk to me about it, you know what? I'm going to always bring up this. But remember that night about that 5K? Remember how tough it was? That was probably one of the toughest things you ever did. And you didn't give up. You didn't give up. I'll push you and I encourage you. So again, my people, when you face some struggles, when you face some hardships, get in your word. Pray. Get around some people that will pray for you. Speak to your pastor. And those four things, they will, those four things will help you get out your storm. And once you get out your storm, you're going to look back and you're going to thank God that he pulled you along. Because now you're strong spiritually. Again, it's me, CB. I'm just trying to just touch you guys. Um, I'm going to hit you guys up later. Peace.